Hello YouTube people, I'm back. <laughs> well, almost, I'm getting back. So, these are two completely different watches. And in the real life, both of them get the same amount of likes, which is a lot actually. Except the difference is one of them is trying super extra hard to get those likes, while another one is just meh, but everybody loves it anyway. So you would expect that I would say, ah, this one is not so good because it tries extra hard to get those likes. And this one is just superior, superior, uh, extra wonderful because it just, it, it doesn't even try and everybody likes it. And the fact is, I like them both very, very much. I like them both. Except this one is, um, it, it, it hardly can be everyday watch. It's a little bit too heavy, a little bit too much. Wonderful watch, but for every day, eh, I'll put it aside, okay? While this one, for every day, it's absolutely incredible, everyday watch. I wasn't expecting that. One of you subscribers emailed me. Uh, you said that I like Casio F91W, so I'm probably gonna like this one as well. Casio, um, wait a second, <laughs> MQ24. And to be honest, at first I checked out Amazon and I was like, eh, it's plastic a watch. I don't know nothing special about it. And it costs 15 euros. I don't really, I know, no, I'll pass this one. So, and several months later, I was scrolling Amazon and this watch kind of popped back up on my screen <laughs> and I remembered it and I was like, eh, okay, let's take it. Let's just try it out. And uh, I'm so glad I did. I my I, wow. <laughs> I like from the moment I put this watch on my hand. I'm so amazed by this watch, by simplicity. This is one of those extreme end watches where, well, what I mean is like in the pictures and in, in the videos, it doesn't look anything special. It's small, it's not shiny, it's not in your face, you know, it's not loud. It's just, eh, it's just a cheap plastic watch. That's what I thought. But after putting it on my wrist, after trying it out, I can tell you one thing. This is my favorite watch right now. I have many watches right now because I'm preparing for the upcoming watch review season. Uh, so I have many watches. I can choose any watch I want to wear throughout the day, right? I still grab this the most often. And you know, I liked it so much to the point where I would like, you know, I receive a watch, a new watch, I take it out of the box. And you know this honeymoon period, like when you get a new toy and you enjoy it, like, uh, I don't know, any any watch, like, it's wow, wonderful. Uh, and I have to test drive it to form my opinion about it. But always deep inside my mind, I still thinking about getting back to this Casio. No matter what watch I'm test driving or, you know, trying out unboxing and I always back in my mind keep thinking, I, I, I wanna go, go back to this one. It's like, you know, it's like you are going for a holiday somewhere in a foreign country. You're enjoying it very much. Like, well, the weather is nice. Uh, the water is, beautiful blue and palm trees and such okay but always in back of your head you're thinking mm, i kind of want to go back home <laughs> at least me at least happens to me so that's how this watch feels it feels home sorry i had to go so this is part two of the of the same video <laughs> honestly i could talk about this watch all day long i love it very much and even my wife when she noticed this watch she was like, hmm, that's a nice watch. <laughs> that means a lot. She usually doesn't like watches. She is very critical towards watches and she likes this one. So that means a lot to me. And my mom, also my mom, she noticed this watch and she was like, wow, such a good watch. Show it to me. I showed it to her and she was like, you have to buy one for me. I like it so much. You have to buy it for me. Okay. <laughs> Here is the one that I bought for my mom. It's the same watch. I haven't even unboxed it yet. 
So I will give it to my mom on Sunday, so which is two days from today. <laughs> That's how much people around me like this watch, including me. I absolutely love this watch. Uh, you see, Kashev 921W is one of the most comfortable watches ever because it's super light, super slim, and this rubber band is also very flexible. But this one has even slimmer rubber band, even more flexible. It's even more comfortable than F9, F91W. It's incredible. It's the most comfortable watch I ever had. Uh, specifications, let's measure it very quickly. The thickness is 7.9 millimeters. Uh, diameter 33.5 millimeters. And lug to lug distance is 38.2 millimeters. It's a very small watch though very small watch but don't be afraid of that because it doesn't really look like ordinary watch it looks like a rubber band that happens to have a watch on it as well so you just you have to try it you know 15 euros come on it's the, it costs the same for me to go to the cinema buy a ticket buy popcorn and that's 15 euros for the fun for two hours that's it and this 15 euros Two months later, I'm still having so much fun with this watch. It's like, it's incredible. Can't think of negative points, really. I, I, I could talk and talk about this watch. You know, another positive point that I found out uh, from practice, practical reasons, is, for example, this Casio MTP-1200 has sapphire crystal and black dial. And it collects fingerprints like crazy. Oh my god, like... When I wear this watch, I just keep cleaning it and cleaning it and cleaning. And for example, this one also has sapphire crystal, but it has silver dial. And it also collects fingerprints. But to see them, I have to look at a specific angle, then I notice those fingerprints. But like ordinary, just checking the time, looking at the watch, I don't see fingerprints because the dial is bright. So it kind of pops out stronger, so I don't see fingerprints. With this, not only the dial is bright, so I don't see fingerprints that much, but plastic window doesn't really get that fingerprints that easily. It's great, it's wonderful. And because of that, I don't really see small scratches that much, so they don't bother me too much. And they are very easy to fix as well. So, uh, let's rate this watch into my website thomaswatchreviews.com where I rate watches into different tier lists god tier easy <laughs> easy god tier like it's incredible it's incredible okay enough guys it's not a recommendation you should try it just go ahead and buy it 15 euros for this much fun I'm pff, wow wow <laughs> this watch is just it's a must. You must buy it. That's it. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.